lecture, I am going to discuss about how to connect MySQL database with DB Visualizer. So let's open the DB Visualizer. You can see this is the editor of the DB Visualizer. So first you need to click on this plus. Then you can get this all option. Let's uh, write there MySQL. So here if 5 version is there, you can select this. This is for 8 and this here MySQL direct. So here I am going to use 8. Double click this. Then you can get this option. So MySQL 8. Here server info this all. Database server. This is port automatically it's taken. Database name. We need to get that. And here user ID and the password. So for this one let's open there MySQL workbench. So here MySQL workbench. So this is here root is the user. Localhost this is port 3306. So login with the root. Give the password. This is connected here. And the schema that I am using Sakila this all database that's present there. So let's fill this return. So here giving the database username. Let's give here root. Give the password. And the next is database. Let's give. So going to connect with the Sakira. And after giving this all data connect, let's click on this connect. So here you can see MySQL connector J, MySQL connector 8.306. So this here connected. And here MySQL 8 that's come there. Let's so select. So here you can see default database secular that's come there. So inside you can see this bunch of tables present there. Let's so right click there. Then you can see here alter table options. And open you can see this. And here you can click on this script. Then you can see select a statement that's come there. So you can create the script from this table. Let's right click. Then you can see here opening new tab option that is there. So you can see this all details. This is here column details you can get. This is data details, row count 107. Here you can get your primary key, index, primary key, then index, grant. This all features you can get here. Row ID is this, is there. 